What's up everybody? Well, I got another gameplay video for you guys today and today we're gonna check out Mortal Kombat 11 on my main computer here and finish that game up. So before we hop in though and look at the settings and all that stuff, let's just go through the specs for any new guys who are just coming in just for this one game. So this computer has a 13900 KF, it's got a RTX 4090 MSI gaming trio, it's got an ASUS Z790 gaming E motherboard, 32 gigs of 6600 megahertz DDR5 that's been tuned so it's got super tight secondary timings and all that good junk. We have a 1600 watt EVGA pl uh, Platinum rated PSU. Then we have a custom loop with an EK Velocity 2 block cooling the CPU with a 420 watt, or watt, 420 millimeter radiator here with some Noctua 140 millimeter fans. And then what everybody stares at here, we have a LG C1 OLED TV. It's 48 inches, as I said, OLED, 120 hertz. It's got G-Sync and FreeSync, and it has HDR. Pretty much everything I could ask for in a gaming monitor, only supersized. But everything about this setup is freaking supersized. That's why the damn computer's named Big Chungus, because it is. Everything connected to it's Big Chungus. But anyway, why don't we now hop into the game, quickly look at the settings, and then we will see how it runs. Now, I'm gonna, since this game has two modes, I'm going to try like I did on the laptop. We'll try DX12 mode first, then we'll go into DX11, see which one works better. They might be completely the same on a PC system like this. And then we'll come back at the end and get some camera recorded gameplay too. So without wasting any more time, let's get into the game. Now for the main computer here. Now this time we're going to play at 4K, and we're going to do the same thing we did at the ASUS G50 Advantage and do DirectX 12 and then DirectX 11. And we're just leaving VSync on because it's 60 FPS anyway, doesn't matter what you do, that's just what it is, so why have screen tearing for no reason, right? And normally I'd turn motion blur off, but I just want to do the maximum preset and that turns that on, so I decided to leave it on even though I don't like motion blur. Anyway though, let's go hop into the game, shall we? Well, here we go. DirectX 12 mode first, maxed out, 4K. Still a teensy bit of starter in the, the beginning, little sequences here, but way smoother than anything else I've played on so far. But let's just keep on kicking this guy's ass. My headphones are beeping at me, so they're probably going to die soon, but hopefully I can at least get through these last two segments here. I just got to finish up this DirectX 12 and then a draw a DirectX 11 and then I'm all done. Then I can plug them in. Oh, I don't like getting stuff under 20% battery too often. But it is what it is. Sometimes you got to do it. Because I want to not have any sound if I can help it. And if they die, I'll have to just plug them in and use them wired. Well, I finish up, no big deal. Technically, they would get higher sound quality that way anyway, but they get such good quality anyway, even wireless. I barely notice a difference when I plug them in. I can notice a teensy difference, but barely compared to other things. It's like, okay, wow, this is way better. Still a win? Alright, let's try another fighter. Who shall we pick? Why not? And we'll have him fight this guy. And it loads very fast here. I sense you have lost faith in me. They say you'll send me to my death. Even gods make mistakes, Kung Lao. Round one. Fight. <laughs> All right, yeah, medium people seem to kick my ass a lot more. I don't think I'm ready for medium yet. Still worth a shot, though. Man, I can barely land a hit on the motherfucker. 
Oh yeah, he's got me good. Oh well, no biggie. Hopefully I can win round two. Alright, well at least I hit him so he can't get a perfect on me. That's always a good thing. I get irritated when anyone, especially computers, just beat my ass so easily they get a perfect and I can't even hurt them. But... Alright, cool. But, now it's time to move on to DX11. Well, alright. So, now we're gonna do DX11. Same 4K and whatnot. Everything's on maximum. So let's just quickly go through these settings real fast, and then we'll get back into the game. Alright, that is the bottom. So, into the game we go. Okay, here we go with some DX11. Maxed out 4K, so let's hits. see how this works. And yours as your all punches. What we have here is a contest. I will probably Sorry. lose that contest, but let's try anyway. So far, it's not looking good. At least I damaged him, and that's about it. That would definitely kill you. <laughs> nope, she got me good. Alright, well, to the next character, I guess. Who shall we be this time? Alright, yeah, why not? Johnny Cage. Alright. No, well, let's keep it on medium. I'll still probably lose, but Tournament. who cares? If I don't increase their difficulty, I'll never get any better. Keep my blood inside me, thank you. There's enough to share. Where's that green glow when I need it? Round one. Fight. Stab, stab. Why? Well, at least I managed to stab him a few times. All right, gotta figure out this freaking chick's abilities. All right, that makes something pop down out of the sky, but. I'd have to knock him back for that to work. And throw like blood on him to like blind him. I can throw shit at him, that was fun. Oh nope, he got me there. That's his finisher with that amount of life. I'm definitely toast. Still though, the FPS and the frame times and everything seem pretty much equal to 12 on something like this. So you might as well just use 12. Why the hell not? It wasn't like a stutter city or anything, so. Damn, he dodged it. Then I got my face crushed in. Ah, 
All right. I got a win. But now we've got to finish this final round here. Can I win or will I lose? We'll have to find out. But I'll also take a hit. Why the hell not? Nope, no cool finisher, just a quick stab. Anyway, now we shall move on to that camera. Well, all right, guys. Let's get some camera recorded gameplay now. Trick. I punch you. Select a new fighter. Hmm, let's see. All right. Let's see how I do. Probably gonna get my ass handed to me again, but. It's all good. Your fire won't burn you, Jack. My kicks will break you. Or break your ankle. Crankle. Good at freezing me, that's for sure. I couldn't hit nobody when I was him. Punch, punch, kick. Round two begins. Let's go try another person. Screw it. Now I want to be him. Who shall we fight?
Deadpool it is. Yeah, see what I mean? When I was this guy, I couldn't do shit with them, and now these the computer is doing some really cool ass moves. See how I can do in round two. Kicking my ass this time. Damn. He got me. Well, here we go with the final round. Which he is probably going to win because medium CPUs kick my ass. They're way better than me. I have to stay on low until I learn what for to do, I think. Straight. But all right then, let's go wrap this video on up now. Well, all right guys, that is a wrap for Mortal Kombat 11 on the main computer and a wrap for the game as a whole. Unless somebody wants to see me do the laptop at 4K or something like that. But in any case, it handled it just fine on either DirectX 11 or 12 on this thing. So it doesn't really matter which one you use. Might as well just use a 12 though. I don't see any reason why not, unless it's a stutter city like it was at 1080p on my laptop. It's really the only place I really had problems with it. So I didn't try that on the Steam Deck because it said Windows only. So I figured it couldn't handle it. Probably should have tried anyway, but it's the one thing I didn't try DirectX 12 on. Anyway though, that is about all we got for this particular video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, because I sure as hell enjoyed making it for you guys. And until the next video, peace out guys.